Hey guys, welcome to Car Mechanic Simulator episode 36. Hope you guys enjoy it. It is like 1 o'clock in the morning, exactly 1 a.m. I can't sleep, so why not do another episode? I did the episode 35, um, like two, three hours ago, three hours ago, because that was around 10 o'clock. Yeah. Got the rubber bushings. I thought I had them already, but I must have been rushing around a little too much. Because right after I um, did the other episode, I did this episode. Well, I uh, tore this car apart right after the other episode. No fuel tank. Got the fuel tank in. Oops. A little too zoomed in. Pretty sure I have all the parts for this. Uh, for one side, I hope I have all the parts because if I do, that means I got all the other parts for the other side. I do have all the parts for this side, so I'm good. a low rider so I had to go with the low profiles. I didn't have to but I decided to. They're a size 17 inch rim with a 17 inch tire with a wall of 35. Either 35 or 45, whatever the, whatever the lowest you could go, I put it on. Small rubber bushing. This should take about 10 minutes to put together. I'm not really too sure, depending on how quick I can actually do this. Start working on the motor. Oop, can't work on the motor yet. Front end's not together.
trying to go as quick as possible. We have almost leveled up again. We have another 300 points. To go. And after the 300, well after about now 200 more, we will be able to actually level up again. Be a level 35. I don't think I can get any garage points until, like, I think it's level 40. It's not like Fallout. Every time you get to, you know, every time you level up, you get to do a perk point or a garage point. Well, can't do that. It's okay, though. Let's get that in there. Let's go get the... Shock. I'm running into everything. These tires actually look nice in this. Let's lower it. Just so we can take care of some stuff. Oh, I do have a battery. I actually didn't think I had a battery. Now, time for the motor. Oops. see if we can do one piston at a time. This is a one car motor. I'm trying to use up the motors in my storage room right now. So that's why it's the way it is. And the reason why the episodes are going to be like 25 minutes long when it comes to these V8 motors is because they have more parts in them than the other two motors that I've been working on. I'm not too sure. But they have a tiny bit more parts. And the next car I'll be working on are the two cars that you guys probably seen me walk by. I have like kind of like a goldish racing car that's a uh, older car and it has like a rotary motor that you actually have to put together it's that car way in the background right there my thing's going around it and then we got this car for the next episode motor together and the car together. We're going to rotate the motor once we get this all well, the front together of the motor.
getting there. Looking good for a one carb. One carburetor. Oops. Oh! Didn't even do that. Now it's probably going to be 30 seconds a little. 30 seconds more. <sighs> Sometimes these motors are a pain. Let's see if we can get onto the. There we go. I don't get why my. Uh, I wish my sensitivity would slow down on that. On the. Uh, like the cursor. Is there a way to make that slower? I wonder. guys are into Fallout, um, I'm doing another playthrough of Fallout 4. Now this is my second playthrough of Fallout 4 I'm doing, and it's going to be probably the Minutemen, because no one has really talked to me about, you know, what I should do. So I'm just going to do the Minutemen, and then we'll figure it out from there. Now the Minutemen playthrough starts at episode 81. Reason why I did it like that is so it's like episode 1, but I want to keep um, all my Fallout 4 episodes, you know, not like episode 1, episode 2, episode 3, all the way to 80. And then when I get to another character, episode 1, episode 2, episode 3, episode 4. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I will figure out on how to, like, round it off to the nearest 10. So, like, uh, I was going to do, like, my character at, like, um... At, um, like, episode 79, I'm like, no, I'm gonna go explore more. So, uh, episode 79 was my old, my first character, but, uh, we were just walking around and trying to find, um, crashes. So we found some crashes, and then episode 80 is when I started, episode 81, I believe, is when I started the new playthrough. Yeah, because episode 80, I went and did a, um, I think we looked for a vertebrate, and then episode, I think like, um, 81 is when I get my new character in there. And episode eight, uh, 79 was, or 78 was me taking a look at the shelter that one of the mayors made. So there's, you know, the story behind that in my um, channel too. So if you guys like watching lore videos, I try to get all the lore that I could find and all that and all the videos, but uh, sometimes I forget some things, and that's why I'm doing other characters, so I can go over the same areas and maybe I can find something that I missed the last time I played. Oh yeah, um... Take motor. Install motor. Put the car up. Car 
looks really nice. Okay. So all it's missing is a license plate and transmission, of course. Let's see if we even have it. We do. Do we have a starter though? No, we do not. Do we have a drive shaft? Yeah, we do. Let's go get a license plate. Let's do Georgia. Nice. Just lower it. Put oil in it. I think this stock has 258 horsepower. Let's check. Let's see, motor 258. Now let's go to move car, dyno. Let's dyno the lowrider rhino. basically doubled it. 300 horsepower more. Almost. Nice. Looks real nice too. How much money is it worth? Um, car status. 65,480 plus a 13,098 $96 bonus. It's worth $78,576. nice now this car in the light it looks kind of weird it's chrome I chromed I made the car chrome why did I do that mm, to match the rims the rims are these I put them in my storage so they weren't in my inventory um, these ones right here but they're orange and I'll show you they actually look nice on the car I just want to show you guys those are the rims so I'll show you what it's going to look like I mean, the yellows almost match. They do match almost. It's either they do match almost or they match one of the two. But I liked it. I actually like this car, but I'm not going to keep it or anything. I'm selling it. Well, that's the car. We're not working on this car. We're working on the other car. Next episode. So... Hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. If so, definitely give it a thumbs up to really help me out. It means a lot to me.
So those are the shocks for the next car. Oh, this is the car that I'll be working on, so let's take the transmission out. So it's a Gearbox R O T A. Alrighty guys, so let's take the motor out of the car. Just so you guys can take a look at the motor. Um, okay, crane, car lift A, pull motor, exhaust. Really? Let's move this car over one. Lift that up. Let's go under here. Try to find the exhaust. There it is. Now let's take it out. This is a mess. Wow. I'm not going to be taking it apart because usually after I, uh, when I take slowly take them apart, I um, buy all the parts for them when I put them back together. So guys, this will be the end of the episode. Thank you so much for watching episode 36. Please have a great day. Well. Please like and subscribe, and have a great day. Peace. I'm getting tripped over on my words.